is the uh, what do they mean by large cap, small cap, medium cap stocks? What's the cap part of it mean? I don't fully understand that. That's a great question, uh, Jeff. Uh, thank you for asking. Uh, so, cap is short for capitalization. In other words, what's the market? How much capital? It, does this company particularly have? So a company like a big oil company, uh, I use Kinder Morgan for an example because we were just talking about that. Uh, Kinder Morgan has a, a, a market. The market capitalization is $43 billion. That makes it a large cap company, $43 billion with a B, dollars. Now, they have a value, the value of the company is $70 billion. So, you know, because obviously they've got infrastructure and wells and all those kinds of things. So, but the, the market capitalization is what it stands for. So, there, there's also a micro cap company. So, a micro cap, the going back down to the smallest, where, so I just gave you an example of uh, a a large cap, a micro cap may only have $25 million. So you, you can see the, the, um, the huge difference. Now, so ExxonMobil is a large cap. I just said Kin Kinder Morgan's worth about $45 billion. That's a large cap. ExxonMobil is $400 billion dollars so they're they're getting close to a half a trillion dollars a mid cap company could be could be worth um w would probably be worth somewhere around a hundred billion uh down to uh, i don't know uh nine nine hundred eight hundred nine hundred million no probably not probably uh in the billion lower billion range and then a small cap would be worth, you know, somewhere between 50 million and 100 million or 50 million and, and 900 million, somewhere in that neighborhood. And then the micro cap would be even smaller than that. So it, it, puts, it puts companies in categories. So obviously, we assume that a large cap company is a lot more stable. They have a lot more staying power because they control so much of their market, whatever the market is, oil industry, industrial, uh, whatever it is. So uh, capitalization is important for people like me to make, make certain decisions. So if you wanted to be all in stocks, but you wanted to be in safe stocks, as safe as possible, none of them are safe, but as safe as possible, you would gravitate towards the large, the large companies. Uh, particularly the large domestic companies, the U.S. companies. So the riskier, like a micro cap is far more riskier than ExxonMobil, you know, or a large cap company. And that's why that's important for us to, to know that.